Hi, welcome to video introduction and demonstration for GeoVision Storage System V2 solution. My name is Derek, and I will briefly introduce what GeoV Storage System V2 is and what features it supports. At the end of this presentation, we have also got a couple of demo clips to show you how to create a RAID volume for a host so that you can have the desired host assigned to the hard drive and the detailed hardware structure of the Storage System V2, such as power supply and fan replacement. All right, let's get started. Before we get into the main point, let's take a quick look at the outline here. In this product introduction video, I will go through the hardware design of GV Storage System V2, explain what IPSEN and iSCSI are, which are the protocols used for connecting between hosts and the storage, the system connection diagram, main features, see what benefits you can receive by adopting Storage V2, and after we're done with the main features, we got a couple of clips for system setup and hardware design. Now let's move to the next slide and take a look at how exactly GV Store System V2 looks like. Here we go. As you can see, this is a hardware design of GV Storage System V2. On your left hand side, it is the front view of the system. It is equipped with 24 hard drive. Apart from that, it can also connect to another 7 units of 24 GV expansion systems, giving you a total of 192 hard drive. And on your right hand side, it is the rear view of the system. It has a fully redundant components, including power supply, fan modules, and SAS JBLD expansion ports linked to GV expansion system, 6 GB data ports, and one web management interface enabled on specific Ethernet interface. All of these components are hot swappable to create a high availability platform and provide non-stop services. Here is a very basic diagram showing you how Hostess and GV Storage System V2 are connected each other. First of all, you need to have your IP devices connect to GV surveillance software. It doesn't matter if it is GeoVision IP cameras or other third-party devices. And also through the iSCSI protocol, you can have your hostess assigned to record to GV Storage System V2. The Storage System V2 is equipped with 24 hard drives like we mentioned in the previous slide. And it can connect to 7 units of 24 bay GV expansion systems, which gives you a total of 192 hard drives. So what is iSCSI and what is IPSEN? As we mentioned in the outline, these two protocols are used for connecting between hosts and storage. iSCSI is Internet SCSI, an Internet Protocol Storage Networking Standard for linking data storage facilities developed by the Internet Engineering Task Force. By carrying SCSI commands over IP networks, it can be used to facilitate data transfers over either LAN or WAN and to manage storage over long distances. For IPSense, it uses the IP protocol to connect storage area networks in remote locations. SANS can be extended across the metropolitan area networks and wide area networks without distance limitations. Alright, there are seven major features of GV Storage System V2. It is priced for its privacy, flexibility, and data transfer speed. It is cost effective. GV Storage System V2 is a one time investment so you don't have to pay extra fees in the future. It has been compatible with the GV system software. It also supports virtualization, which gives you multiple environments to install different software. And lastly, it offers RAID storage without any drivers needed. Feature number one, enterprise level shared storage solution over the network. GV Storage System V2 is priced mostly for its privacy, flexibility, and data upload speed. Unlike with the cloud storage, you have a complete control over your data, where it is stored, and who has access to it, and what happens to it. It is not stored in some remote location where you have only control access to it. In the current state of the world, data privacy and security are just like brothers. Many consider local storage maintain them together more than cloud storage does. With the GV Storage System V2, you have easy and quick access to your data and require no internet connection to do so. Feature number two, it is more cost effective than cloud storage. GV Storage System V2 features a lasting network storage solution for one-time investment. It has significantly lower cost per terabyte over a three-year period with a ration of 10 to 1. Unlike with local storage, if you want to store a lot of information in the cloud storage, 
you will probably have to pay for the service fee year by year, and also it requires an internet connection to access your data. Feature number three, GV Store System V2 is compatible with Dual Vision surveillance system and software. With his large storage capacity and high availability, GV Store System V2 is an ideal choice for the safe and long-term data storage. It is compatible with the VMS, DVR, MVR, Backup Center, Recording Server, and lastly, it is also compatible with the redundant server and failover server. Feature number four, virtualization. It is the process of creating a software-based representation of something rather than a physical one. It can apply to application, servers, storage, and networks. It is the single most effective way to reduce IT expenses while boosting efficiency for all-size businesses. Feature number five, a super storage with 192 hard drive. Compared to other PC-based system and NAS system, which only allow for four to eight hard drive for data storage, GV Storage System V2 is equipped with 24 hard drive, and it can also connect to seven units of 24-bay GV expansion systems, giving you a total of 192 hard drives. Feature number six, cutting edge IP sense storage solution. Through the iSCSI protocol, in addition to his ability to link to multiple devices, hosts, and server over standard IP networks, GV Store System V2 can also be scaled and used by any type of network and combination of operating systems supporting iSCSI, as well as protected by security and multipath mechanism. Last feature is fully redundant hot swappable components and data protection. Today's hard drive and solid state drive are far more reliable than their predecessor, which make them perfect candidates for RAID. As we mentioned, RAID can increase storage performance or offer some level of redundancy. By the way, there are a few things to keep in mind before setting up a RAID on existing system. If you are starting fresh with a new system, there are no preparation needed. Just make sure you have got the drive connected to the right ports on your system. If you are on an already configured system, there are many, many considerations. What we recommend is to back up all of your data, so if something goes wrong and you lose data, you'll be happy to have the backup in place. We got a couple of demo videos here, and I'm going to show you how to create a RAID volume for a host in the next video. For the other videos about hardware, please refer to the following YouTube links for more information.
All right, the information we covered in this video is pretty much about GV Storage System V2. I hope the information addresses your needs. And once again, thank you for your interest in GeoVision products. If you want to know more details about the product, please visit our website, which is geovision.com.tw, and go to GV Storage System V2 and GV Expansion System. And for order information, please email at salesgeovision.com.tw. If you need any technical assistance, please email at support.jewelvision.com.tw. Alright, thank you for watching. My name is Derek.